Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh And good morning to you girls I'm teacher Orsalia T. Makawir of Northeast District 1 under Marawi City Division Welcome to the supplemental video of Grade 5 Math Quarter 1, Week 8 entitled Dividing Fractions at the end of this video, pupils are expected to visualize division of fractions and divide simple fractions and whole numbers by a fraction and vice versa. Pupils, I hope you have with you your notebook, ball pen, and module. Before we move on, Let's review first our previous lesson entitled Solving Routine and Non-Routine Problems Involving Multiplication of Fractions since we can use this for our next lesson. 1 and 5 over 9 times 1 and 1 half. How did we get the answer? For the solution, first, you copy 1 and 5 over 9 times 1 and 1 half equals 1 and 5 over 9 is equal to 14 over 9. This is changing mixed number into improper fraction. So, 9 times 1 plus 5 equals 14 over 9. And in the same way, 1 and 1 half equals 3 halves. Then, you multiply the numerators 14 and 3 as well as the denominators 9 and 2. Check if the numbers can be factored out to apply cancellation. For 14, it is equal to 2 times 7. 9 is equal to 3 times 3. Cancel out 2 and 3. The remaining is 1. So, the answer is 7 thirds or 2 and 1 third. Number 2. What is the result if you multiply 14 by 5 over 7? Great! You are correct! The answer is 10. For the solution, you change the whole number 14 into 14 over 1. Factor out 14 into 2 times 7. Multiply the remaining numerators and denominators after applying the cancellation. So, the answer is 10. Number 3. Norlaila bought three-fourth dozen of roses. She gave one-fourth of it to Nor Alia. How many roses did Nor Alia receive? Amazing! You are correct! The answer is 3. For the solution, 1 third times 3 fourth equals multiply the numerators 1 and 3 as well as the denominators 3 and 4. You will get 3 over 12 and this can be reduced to its lowest term 1 fourth. 1 fourth of a dozen is 1 fourth times 12. Of means times. Dozen means 12. 
change the whole number 12 into 12 over 1, factor out 12 as 4 times 3, cancel out 1 and 4, so the answer is 3. Therefore, Nor Aliyah received 3 roses. Alright, are you ready now for our next lesson? Let us try this problem number 1. Norseria has 3 and 1 fifth meters of ribbon. She wants to cut it into smaller ribbons measuring 2 feet of a meter per cut. How many smaller ribbons can she make? For the solution, you copy 3 and 1 fifth divide because we are looking for the number of smaller ribbons can Norsalia make. You copy 2 fifth equals, change the mixed number 3 and 1 fifth into improper fraction 16 over 5. Copy the division symbol, copy 2 fifth equals, copy 16 over 5, change the operation division into multiplication, get the reciprocal or multiplicative inverse of 2 fifth which is now 5 over 2 equals factor out 16 into 2 times 8 cancel out 2 and 5 so the answer is 8 hence Norsalia can make 8 smaller ribbons the fractions 2 fifths and 5 halves are reciprocals or multiplicative inverses of each other because their product is 1 here are more examples of reciprocals or multiplicative inverse. In number 1, 4 over 5 becomes 5 over 4. In number 2, 5 becomes 1 fifth. It is understood that 5 has a denominator of 1. In number 3, 2 and 3 fifth is equal to 13 over 5. This is changing mixed number into improper fraction. Then, 13 over 5 becomes 5 over 13. To find the reciprocal of a mixed number, write it as an improper fraction first. Problem number 2. Divide 3 over 20 by 1 fifth. For the solution, you copy 3 over 20, divide 1 fifth equals... Copy again 3 over 20, change divide into times, then get the reciprocal of 1 fifth which is 5 over 1 equals, combine the numerators 3 and 5, factor out 20 into 4 times 5 to apply the cancellation, cancel out 5, multiply the remaining in the numerator and denominator, so the answer is 3 fourth. Number 3. What is the quotient of 6 and 2 fifths? For the solution, you copy 6, divide, and 2 fifths equals. Change the whole number 6 into 6 over 1. Copy, divide, and 2 fifths equals. Copy 6 over 1. Change divide into times. Get the reciprocal of 2 fifth, which is 5 halves, equals factor out 6 into 2 times 3 to apply cancellation. Cancel out 2, multiply the remaining, so the answer is 15. Number 4. What is 3 and 1 half divided by 1 and 2 thirds? For the solution, you copy 3 and 1 half divided by 1 and 2 third equals change the mixed number 3 and 1 half into improper fraction 7 over 2. Change also 1 and 2 third into 5 over 3 equals you copy 7 over 2, change divide into times. Get the reciprocal of the divisor 5 over 3, which is 3 over 5. 
multiply the numerators 7 and 3 as well as the denominators 2 and 5. You will get 21 over 10. And we will change it into mixed number. So, 21 divided by 10 equals 2 with a remainder of 1. The quotient 2 is the whole number. The remainder 1 is the numerator and retain the denominator 10. So, the answer is 2 and 1 over 10. Remember that the general rule in dividing fractions is a over B divided by C over D equals A over B times B over C equals A times B over B times C. To divide mixed numbers, change them into improper fractions, then follow the rules in dividing fractions. Now, for me to check if you have understood our lesson, please try to answer this activity. Find the quotient from number 1 up to number 4. You have 40 seconds to answer. Your timer starts now. Very good! Job well done! Let's check now your answers! As you can see on the left side is the answer and on the right side is the solution. In number 1, the answer is 120 over 7 or 17 and 1 over 7. Here is the solution. In number 2, the answer is 8 over 9. This is the solution. In number 3, the answer is 21 over 4 or 5 and 1 fourth. Here is the solution. In number 4, the answer is 5 over 4 or 1 and 1 fourth. This is the solution. Pupils, mathematics is not a boring subject. You just need to apply the saying, practice makes perfect. To enjoy learning the subject. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye, pupils. Maasalam.